Alrighty then, good afternoon once again all you fantastic people, uh, Silver Dragon here, coming at you with some more RimWorld, could be continuing where we last left off. Now, it looks like a few people are actually really close to breaking right now, uh, CAGs here especially, so let's actually get you back here and give you something to eat, because I do not want you breaking. I do not want any of them breaking, honestly, but I especially don't want, well, no, just any of them. There you go, that should make them happier. And now we can go rest. There we go. So I'm hoping that torch will help to... Ah, oh, you serious? You got in... God damn it, useless people. Okay, who is my next best character for medicine? If anybody. If you don't mind, even if you do, I don't care. Fuuuuck, <sighs> infection. That sucks. Gonna have to deal with that, that's important. Eat, go to bed. good for kegs. So... We're gonna use that for the infection later. I should have used it initially. That was my mistake. I didn't do so. I need to get a heater going here too. Oh, it is actually a medical bed. Go rest and I'll send him to heal you. Immediately, please. Critical alert, hypothermia. I have a serious hypothermia even. Jesus. Are you kidding me? It's not one thing, it's another. It really is never ending, isn't it? And yes, I'm still enabling this because I know that drives somebody nuts. <laughs> Alright. 
Really? Mm, I'm definitely gonna have to look up the mods in this pack, and you know what? Let me do that right now because this is beginning to drive me nuts. If they did re-add that mod, I swear to God, I am going to disable disable the shit out of it because it's really hard enough to survive in SK as is, but then they add all these additional moods, and it's just like, are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? Alpha 17 Hardcore SK. Uh, Project Fallout. Industrialization. Yada yada yada. Cats. Fantastic cats. Rim Wars. Hmm. New factions, hall priority, definitely useful for that. Additional joy objects. Uh, hospitality, no. Infused, enchant weapons and apparel, no. Medical info, no. Uh, fluffy breakdowns. Places random breakdowns with actual game mechanic. That's probably the one I'm looking for. Let me look up the Steam community page for that. Uh, building uses components will gradually deteriorate. That's literally all it says. It replaces the random breakdowns with a maintenance requirement? Oh, okay, it's talking about the, uh, that's, that's for, um, fuck, what's it called? That's just for the repairing of all of the buildings, that's why. Really? Manhunting freaking tarantulas, are you shitting me? Uh... Yay, cold snap over, fantastic. Where are you going right now? No. Actually, might need you in a second. Oh my god, huge damage, what the hell, are these tarantulas or some kind of, oh my god, how, how can they do that much damage? Holy shit. Holy shit. That was insane. That was beyond insane. Rimworld, you never seem to stop. You just don't want to give me even the slightest chance to live.
God damn. If you could see my freaking face of just absolute shock right now. Are you? Oh. Oh. Fucking tarantula. Even a giant tarantula. Oh. Dear God. The amount of face palm and just. Uh, Rimworld. You RNG fucking bastard. <laughs> <sighs> the sigh is real, man. The sigh is real. That was just... That was just nonsense. Absolute, absolute goddamn nonsense. Then again, I mean, I wouldn't necessarily equate this game with anything remotely resembling logic, let's be honest. Spoil everything in there. Severe illness. <sighs> we didn't have the chance to deal with it. There's too many other things. Oh, why? Why won't you give me even the littlest chance to live and have a successful colony room world? Dear God, it's just constant. This is Dark Souls level bullshit here now. Levels of masochism is what this game has become. Oh my God. It's like smashing your fucking head into a wall repeatedly expecting, you know, expecting to be able to put a window in the resulting hole. Sure, I could use the proper tools, but no, I'd rather bash my head into it until it makes an appropriate hole. I mean... This is pretty doomed colony here. We still have toxic fallout going on. Which she's been standing in for how fucking long at this point. I'm I'm so tired of not being able to have even remotely even a remotely successful colony you know I just just once I'd like to be able to have something go right but it's just not happening room world's not that kind of game it seems is just constant failure in the with the slightest hope and chance of something actually succeeding ever so slight <sighs> Fuck. I'm pretty sure this colony is done you're gonna get food poisoning I don't care Martin's still fucking out here, dicking around. Uh, yeah, this colony's pretty much fucked. You know? I just... Uh, don't have a goddamn chance. <laughs> uh, I'm sighing so hardcore right now, and I'm just... It's just sad, you know? I'm just... I just can't get a win. And that's just utterly... 
S just sad. Just really, really sad. They're using bears as pack animals. That's amazing. They have enough chickens here to drown in. I mean, I have to figure out what mod, if there is another mod here now that's causing them to, you know, I might even have to go in and remove, let me look at my needs here. Like, look at this. Grimy, awful bedroom, slept in the cold. It without, why did you eat without a table? We have a table. <sighs> I'm just tired. <laughs> Uh, it's so hard to deal with the morale system. It's like no matter what I do, there's blood everywhere. It's going to cause them to go crazy. There's just a million things that I can't prevent. I don't know what to do. I just don't know what to do. You know? I mean, the worst part about it is, as well is that Hardcore SK requires such a ridiculous amount of resources that if I don't have a high amount of colonists, like even upwards of 10 of them, it takes forever to do anything. Not to mention that the raids we get coming at us are so overwhelmingly powerful that I just don't have the time to prep for that. I'm spending so much time fucking building a million things that require a billion resources that I have nowhere near enough colonists to do because they keep dying or breaking down. And it's fucking making me lose my mind. Ah. <sighs> yeah, I think I've... <laughs> I think I'm tired at this point. Okay, this is really weird. I don't know when it happened or why it happened, uh, but apparently the OBS, cough, the lovely program I use to record, decided to stop recording. I don't know if it was by itself or I accidentally clicked it and just kept, you know, talking and talking and talking this whole time. I'm gonna have to figure out exactly when the hell it cut out, but basically, if I've been going this whole time and not recording any of it, fuck me, for one. Uh, for another, this colony is pretty much done. The toxic fallout has been constant. We've lost people. Uh, the mood is... What the hell? The mood lits have just been absolutely shit constantly, and there's nothing I can do to seemingly stop that. Uh, there's just too many things that need to be done with Hardcore SK, and just I'm seemingly incapable of getting anything done. Ah. <sighs> And so on and so forth. And the frustration levels are just through the goddamn roof. Um, so more than likely what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to take a slight break in a way from Wormworld when it comes to the recording here at least and just stream it for a couple hours and hours on end. You know, go through multiple colonies over and over and over again uh, to get used to a, you know, create a system that I can put in place to make a better series, because right now I'm just seemingly completely ill-equipped uh, to come up with a decent series, so that's really, you know, I'm just getting frustrated. It's really problematic, and I have to do something to make, you know, to really bring some level of uh, success to this idiocy. So I'm going to have to call things here for now uh, for this colony. And we'll have to see what happens for next time. Uh, probably gonna, maybe even tomorrow, stream a bunch of it. Maybe something else as well. We'll see what happens. And we'll see if we can eventually get to a point where we can, you know, come back and have a good strong series. Because right now it's just constant Dark Souls level suffering. And I just, I'm so tired of it. So... We'll see what happens. Till then, thank you very much for watching, guys. Hope you all enjoyed uh, the Alpha 17 series while it lasted. Uh, I'm definitely going to have to look up potentially and see if I can even remove some of the mods that add to, uh, you know, this ridiculous amount of moodlets into the game. Uh, or, well, the negative ones, I should say, at the very least, because it's just a little overpowered right now on the amount of just, like, look at all that. Come on.
Come on. Uh, but anyway, I digress. Thank you very much for watching, everyone. Have a great one. Catch y'all next time. Dragon out.